So where have I been and what's been happening? Well, I've been putting out a video for a little while because I haven't been putting out a video for a little while. Uh, I had some bad digestive issues, so what I did was I decided to do a fast to help um, heal myself from it and also to experiment with fasting properly. I had a great vision of doing it for like, you know, damn ages, but I'm not an experienced faster, so it didn't quite work out that way. I fasted for two days as a water faster and then four days as a juice faster and then brought myself back onto solid food as a result of going via smoothies and that worked very well. The um, fasting to help my digestive problems greatly and also brought me into a greater relationship with how I was um, affecting my body through the way I was living and that's enabled me to now give up the electronic cigarettes and today is the now day four. I've done three complete 24 hour periods without and today is the fourth day and finally I'm not feeling monged out. I don't know whether you've ever done, uh, you know I mean, do, do you know what it's like to be living off nicotine every single day and then for it's like drop, like dropping off a cliff, okay? If you've done recreational substances and you know how knackered it makes, you know, you're just monged out on cheap resin pots and you're just sitting on your backside looking at the floor because that's like the most exciting thing in the world um, and that's all you can do, right? That's where my brain just was. Okay, it wasn't quite as trippy and I certainly wasn't giggling. I was just like completely, I was a fucking zombie. All right, it's just like, oh no. I would go into the kitchen to make myself a cup of tea and by the time I'd got to the kitchen I would forget why I was going to the kitchen. And I'm a habitual tea drinker, okay? Uh, this is like extreme, oh, terrible, terrible, terrible. Uh, and there was some weird, some weird emotionality going along with it as well, kind of like, oh, uh, you know. It was like, mm, combination between like being a, a teenage emo and being stoned and just not functioning on all four cylinders at all. And I started eating. All right, now, now, typically speaking, I've got a hunger. I, I've got an appetite. You know, I, I eat good quality, healthy food. Two bowls of porridge every morning. Okay, that's my, be my typical breakfast. And then I have like a, a number of different, I mean, I have healthy food, you know. Your rice and your pasta with lots of vegetables, lots of beans and all that kind of stuff. And obviously gluten-free stuff because I prefer that. And, and I'll have quite a few portions. But, but now it's a question of not allowing, you know, it's been like an hour would pass. And I'd be thinking, I need food now. Food. What's that food? I mean, in a few weeks time, I'm going to be heavier. There's me stopping, stopping using nicotine to try and heal, you know, part of the process of like healing my digestive system to make sure I don't get digestive system problems in the future. And I'm just cramming myself head fucking first full of food. Makes no sense at all. What, what, the, that's the heat, you know, you just, especially if you're like going somewhere and you've, you've got a little little chores to do go to this place and that place and the other place and there's food shops everywhere selling things like flapjacks and biscuits and all that uh, anyway this is what it's like to give up nicotine only been on it since the age 19 and you're now 40